All of these cheap biotech stocks to buy have major catalysts ahead. These are some of the cheapest biotech stocks with major catalysts nearing. Favon Pharmaceuticals, the company has an upcoming PDUFA date in November. Artelix, the company has a PDUFA date in October, which could push the stock higher. Biolinerx, another cheap biotech stock with a PDUFA date even closer. Let's dive in. Here are the three cheap biotech stocks that smart investors will snap up now. Welcome to Timely Investment Research. One of the safest sectors on the market is biotech. After all, we can't stop people from aging, at least not yet. We have millions of people retiring and demanding better care. There's a good deal of innovation, especially with gene editing. Plus, with a number of heavyweight companies facing patent expirations, many are acquiring cheap biotech stocks to buy to keep pipelines fresh. And, as I mentioned on June 22, pharmaceutical and biotech companies spent about $85 billion on acquisitions. That's well above the $35 billion worth of deals done in 2022 and the $49 billion worth of deals in 2021, as noted by analysts at Stifle. Even more exciting, there are still plenty of cheap biotech stocks to buy with solid catalysts. Number 1. Fathom Pharmaceuticals With a focus on gastrointestinal diseases, Fafon Pharmaceuticals has been moving aggressively higher. In fact, since March, the stock ran from about $6 to $14.65 and and could still see higher highs. Not only did the US FDA accept the company's new drug application resubmission for the treatment of erosive gastroesophageal reflux disease, it set a PDUFA date on November 17. As we near that date, we expect Fafon Pharmaceuticals to push even higher. The company does expect to launch the treatment for erosive gastroesophageal reflux disease by the fourth quarter of the year, pending FDA approval. We also have to consider the global market could be worth as much as $5.95 billion by 2030. Plus, about 14% of the global population is dealing with gastroesophageal reflux disease at the moment, or about 1.03 billion people. Analysts at Needham have a buy rating on the stock with a $23 price target. The firm also noted, Vonaprazin has the potential to be a best-in-class acid blocker and generate approximately $675 million U.S. peak sales in erosive esophagitis. Number 2. Ardelix Another interesting and cheap biotech stock to consider is Ardelix. Over the last few weeks, the stock ran from about $3.40 to $4.20 before pulling back with the market. The stock could push higher with an October 17 FDA catalyst. That's the day the agency is expected to make its decision on XPHOZAH for the control of serum phosphorus in adult patients with chronic kidney disease on dialysis who have had an inadequate response or intolerance to a phosphate binder therapy, as noted by RT News. Even better, analysts at Leidenberg just raised their price target on Artelix to $8.50 from $7.50, with a buy rating. According to Mike Robb, President and Chief Executive Officer, Pending FDA approval, the company is looking forward to bringing this novel therapy to patients in the fourth quarter of this year, delivering on a promise to patients and the vision of Artelix for the second time in two years. Number 3. Biolinarx. The last time I mentioned Biolinarx, it traded at $1.20 on May 4. After hitting a high of $1.82, it now trades at $1.57 and could test higher highs. As I mentioned on May 4, the company just announced the FDA acceptance of its APHEXDA, Mochexafortide, new drug application. This is for stem cell mobilization for autologous transplantation in multiple myeloma patients. There's a PDUFA target date of September 9. As we near that date, I believe the stock could push aggressively higher. Biolinerx also announced the initiation of a phase 2 clinical trial in first line metastatic pancreatic cancer as I mentioned on July 18. There's hope for success, with metastatic cancer being a fatal disease for which current treatments offer only limited benefits. Thanks for spending some time with us today, Timely Investment Research. We're so glad you did. If you found value in today's video, please give us a like, hit that bell icon to never miss an upload, and hey don't forget to subscribe.